Hey folks, welcome to another day, another unboxing from HP. You know what? I think I should preamble this by telling you something. This is a business laptop, like, you know, for corporate IT people that they seed out to their employees and managers and all that. So you're going to say, really, Miriam, why are you reviewing this? This is not consumer tech. Well, hold up a minute, because look, this thing is cool. This is the HP Elite Dragonfly 13. It's the new business laptop from HP. But honestly, the reason I'm excited is because this is the first laptop that's like for business that I've ever seen that actually looks like really cool and sexy and nice and could make a great consumer laptop. So I figured I'd get one, try it out and let you know what I think. So there it is. As you can see, immediately the box does not look like one of those corporate boxes much nicer than that there's really nothing anywhere just so you know i just got this in the mail this morning and i really have no idea what the specs are on this like there's no specs on any box even the box that this was in so i'm just gonna guess that you know obviously it's an intel based laptop and that's all i know at this point you'll have to go on the website and figure out what configs are when that goes live so there you go let's open it up it's magnetic look at this magnetic very nice all right, dun, 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 boom, look at this. You can immediately see bluish color, like little silver accents. This is very nice. I'm going to pull on here to open this up and we're going to set this aside for later. First, let's look at the rest of the box, shall we? There's some paperwork here. Let's see what it says. Oh, it's a white cloth microfiber thingy. That's nice. And we've got some paperwork. Probably some safety stuff. I don't know. I'm going to throw this over here. What else do we have? A divider. And then we have, oh, a pen. Because, yes, this is a two-in-one with pen and touchscreen support. So here is the typical HP USB-C adapter brick. I'm not going to go in great details about this. It's nice. Got a braided cable. If you've seen some of my other HP laptop unboxing, you're familiar with this brick. And then we've got, of course, the power cable for US prongs with a little condom on the end. Oh yeah, and there's no condom on this end, huh? Anyway, so that's it for that part. Now let's have a look at the pen real quick. Bear with me here, there we go. So in here is a bunch of stuff. Let's have a look at what's in here, shall we? That's what unboxings are all about. Ooh, it's a nice little box. Ah, there we are. And then we've got the HP pen. I think this is very similar to the pen. It came with the HP Folio, the leather laptop from last year. I believe this recharges over USB-C, which is kind of cool because you no longer have to put a battery in this thing. Very nice. Uh, has two buttons on here and a nice tip and a button on the back. And yeah, I don't know how you charge it, but I guess I'll figure it out. I don't want to break it here. So then let's see. Oh. There's a USB-C charge cable. There you go. Told you it's charge over USB-C. USB-C on one end, USB-A on one end. Nice little charge cable. And then that's, I believe, all we've got in here. I'm not sure there's anything else, but nope. It's all box beyond this. So let's have a look at this laptop. HP. Check it out. That is nice. And you can see this is super thin and super light. That's the thing they went for. It's light. It's made of magnesium, machine magnesium, which is super lightweight. Lots of ports. So let's have a look at this. Let me open this up so I can do this and pull it out from underneath here. And let's see. Yes, here we are. HP. Wow. Oh, it feels so nice. It's kind of like a soft touch finish, but it's metal. So it's kind of like anodized aluminum, but it's magnesium. This is very cool. And then you got, you know, the underneath serial numbers and stuff. Who cares? You got um, venting. As you see, even the screws are super fancy. Check it out. Look at those screws. Yeah. And then the hinge has nice little highlights. Now this is a two in one, so it folds completely out into a tablet, right? That's the whole idea. So there we go. There's a look at this nice little divider here. This is a nice effing laptop. I really wish Intel would stop putting these stupid stickers on. So we got a fingerprint sensor, 
a nice, oh, this is cool, so this is a glass trackpad. Not too loud, so you can use this in conferences. Actually, what's cool about this is that they have um, noise cancellation on the keyboard. So when you tap a key and you're on a conference call, you know, again, it's a business laptop, you know, you're doing your video call, Zoom, and if you type while you call it, instead of listening for the sound of the keyboard and try to cancel it out, it tells the audio chip, hey, I'm pressing a key, so it knows preemptively to cancel the noise. So it's faster response, basically, at noise canceling, which is very clever. See speaker vents on the side, Elite book, and here is the display. Let me show you that real quick. There we go. Very small bezel. I don't know if you can see here. Let's actually start it up. Power lock key is on this side somewhere, I think. There we go. See if it starts up. There's an LED that lit up, so give it a second. It should fire right up. As you can see, there is a couple of microphones up here, a camera, HP logo. There's a bit of bezel at the bottom edge. A little bit at the top but the edges as a side this is the width where my nail ends right here on both sides so that's pretty cool it says protected by HP sure smart uh, because this is designed for enterprise and business sure start is their uh, BIOS uh, hack prevention technology because that's uh, becoming a common problem so yeah that's it uh, let me type on this keyboard real quick and tell you what I feel Ah, yeah, it feels nice. The deck is really sturdy. Our backlight, of course, ta-da. As you can see here, that's pretty sweet. You'd expect that, obviously. So I'm not going to set this up, obviously, right now. Let me turn that off and do the 360 thing. Ooh, there we are. So when you put it in 360 mode, that's what it looks like. It's a little thicker in 360 mode. And of course, then you have a tablet now, you see. So that's pretty cool. But what I wanted to show you is the ports because, you know, a lot of thin ultralight, thin laptops today are kind of short on the port front. So this has a USB-A port, power button, Kensington lock. This is for the SIM slot because, yes, this has 4G LTE, folks. Yes, this has a modem in it. Then it has two USB-Cs on this side, headphone jack, and a full-blown, full-size HDMI port because, again, business laptop for IT people must have all the outputs that's super cool so that's it folks this is the hp elite dragonfly 13. it's a super light super thin business or enterprise laptop whatever you want to call it but honestly i think that if i worked for a big company i wouldn't mind being given this as my day-to-day -day laptop i mean this is certainly a far cry from those ugly ugly business laptops from not too long ago so that's it folks Stay tuned for more. I'll have more about this on my podcast. As you know, this entire video channel is a compliment to my podcast, mobiletechpodcast.com. We're on Google Podcasts, Apple Podcasts, Pocket Cast, Overcast, and Spotify. Please subscribe and tell your friends. Also subscribe to this channel, like this video, comment below, hit the notification bell, tell everyone about this channel if you like it, and I'll be back with more videos soon. Until then, cheers everybody.